With opening weekend in full swing, the pressure is on for the Florida State baseball team to prove its potential this upcoming season. I'm Allison Lewis with Epitz View, and let's take a look at this exciting series. The Seminoles are back and better as ever as they executed a strong performance against VCU during their opening weekend series. The freshmen are already making a tremendous impact for FSU, along with the phenomenal pitching staff that returns to the mound. Sophomore right-hand pitcher Drew Carlton started off his season with an incredible outing opening night. However, the Knolls were not quite ready to swing the bats, resulting in a disappointing opening night loss. We will get over and we will be ready to play tomorrow. I'm not saying we're going to come out and win. I'm saying we're going to come out. I will make this prediction. We'll get more than one hit. It definitely did not take long for Florida State to recoil from an opening night shutout as they dominated the remainder of the series. Bats come to life in Saturday's rally with four Seminoles recording their first career hit. Leading off Sunday with a bumpy start, sophomore right-handed pitcher Tyler Holton turned around the tempo and got back into his grind. Um, but it was nice to come back the next two days and, and perform the way we did and kind of put that behind us and, and now we can just look forward. The Seminoles did just that while taking complete control of the last two games of this series. Sunday's victory also marked a milestone for legendary head coach Mike Martin, tacking on win number 1900 in his 38-year career. And with that, the Knolls bounced back from an opening day loss to steal the next two games from BCU. Following this series, FSU will host USF Tuesday evening. For FSVU, I'm Allison Lewis. See you guys next time.